Hey guys, Chris here doing another fish tank video. Doing the damn thing over here, huh? There's been a popular demand on me doing another video on my Jaguar cichlid. So I figured, why not give you guys six reasons to buy a Jaguar cichlid? This is going to be a theatrical laid back sort of vibe. So grab a cold one and maybe some popcorn or whatever you want to chew on and indulge. So number six on my list of reasons to buy a Jaguar Cichlid is their long body type. There's just something about a super long fish. I know that sounds kind of funny, but just sort of think of like eels, snakeheads, bichers. They sort of just stand out a little bit. And next, number five on the list, low temperatures. A lot of people don't know the Jaguar Cichlid can actually withstand pretty low temperatures even in the low 70s. I'm not telling you that you should keep these fish at that, but it has been found that these fish do actually okay in lakes and ponds that get to those temperatures. Number four on the list, this is one of my favorites, the personality of the Jaguar Cichlid. These things are so smart, I'm blown away every single day by how smart my Jags are. And I know some of you guys are thinking, hey Chris, how do we know if the fish is actually smart? And I know, but guys, these fish, they're the first to tell when I'm gonna feed them. They're super hard to catch in a net. I'm telling you, these fish are super intellectually smart. Number three on the list is aggression levels. The Jaguar Cichlid is my absolute favorite level of aggression in a fish, if that makes any sense. I can still comfortably keep tank mates with the fish, and also they still hold down their own to where they're not getting picked on. And I know some of you guys are out there thinking, hey man, my Jag Cichlid was a complete insane psychopath. I couldn't keep anything with him. Yes, some Jaguar Cichlids are like that, especially overly aggressive males in particular. But for the most part, people have commonly kept them with other tank mates successfully. Air quotes. Man, I could get lost in the absolute pure beauty of these fish. If you're having a hard time seeing a reason to buy these fish, I honestly don't know what to tell you, but let's keep going on with the list. Number two, their size. I love the size of these fish. They don't grow too large like an arapaima at like nine feet long. These fish max out at around two feet, and you're rarely gonna see that inside of a fish tank. There are some videos on YouTube of some 20 inch Jaguar cichlids, but it's pretty uncommon. And that video actually was a Jag in like an 800 gallon tank. You're realistically looking at a 14 to 18 inch fish here, maximum growth in a fish tank. So yeah, that's not too large and that's not too small. I feel like that is the perfect size predator fish. All right guys, number one on the list, da 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 da. What is it gonna be? I feel like this is an easy answer. It's the coloration of the fish. I mean, can you not get past the designs? This is why I tattooed this fish on the side of my arm like a weirdo. Man, oh man, do I love me some cichlids. There's a hybrid right there, a Jag and a Texas mixed. A friend gave that to me. What I'm doing here, guys, is I'm having tanks with different size cichlids in them. The tank above is like the six to 10 inch mark cichlids, and the tank below it is like the four inch to six inch cichlids. People always remark on my YouTube channels, hey man, you talk like you know everything about cichlids, but your fish look kind of beat up. The answer to that is cichlids are constantly fighting and playing this game with mixing and matching them is a battle. Anyone who keeps cichlids knows the drill. What I'm saying here is just hold back the hate a little bit, man, because keeping cichlids is a struggle like this. Look at this beautiful bisher here. Bisher, bicker, bicker, cocker, jicker, I don't know what you want to call it. Guys, let me know in the comment section what you think of Jaguar cichlids. I'm just obsessed with cichlids in general, but the Jag is my number one on the list. And yes, I do have tattoos of fish all over my arms. Some of you guys don't know yet, I am a complete weirdo with this stuff. So that's why I make videos so I can hang out with other fish keepers and talk fish. So hit me up in the comment section. Shout out to Jaguar Cichlid Keepers. Join the Facebook group. I don't own it. I don't have anything to do with it. These just these fish are awesome. Get yourself one. Start it as a juvenile. Somewhat of a slow growing fish, but man oh man does it make up for it because when these fish grow to a foot long, it's just pure beauty, guys.